Hi, it's Cassie from Cassie Director and in this short and quick overview tutorial about After Effects CS5 uh, I will show you how the Roto brush works so the Roto brush is about you can select a person and put it where you want it's crazy um yeah I think on this day uh I was getting a dance <laughs> no let's get started uh, I did it before and first I have to say um it's not so time consuming like to make every time to change the frames about the mask um but you have to go frame by frame when you have not really a good contrast and yeah video so maybe like here it get problem about my line and it will get problem with the white and the very light gray corner stuff here so but let's get started choose your clip and go to this on the top on the menu here is Rooter Brush Tool. So click on there, double click on your footage, and it will pop up this. First, you can watch this in Toggle Alpha, but you can't see it because we haven't selected. So here, this green will appear with a plus in. Go and select what you want to have in your. Uh, selected what you want to change to another background maybe so let's get started select a bit rough because roto brush will find the edges so maybe not all edges because here maybe the line I said before I get a problem with that but I think here a bit the corner it's a problem too because yeah so now you see I made a mistake and it's whopping over because this line here it's light gray and the white so now what should I do I don't want to delete it so hit alt and it will go a minus in red and then go over the, the, the um, area you want um, have so maybe like this so and back and here is the same right. uh, hit alt and go a bit over you see it's overlapping so go with green um, till you have your person in it so uh, um, let's remove the microphone so it's get easier next go page down and page up you like and you see rotor brush will find all these edges maybe you have to um, make some corrections but rotoscoping will learn to it it will automatically learn to um, fix the selection in the next frame so let's get one more frame and here you see it you have to fix something but it's very easy I think so let's do it here so now do this in your whole video and I will coming back when I'm finished. So I'm back with my clip and now you see here the purple line. You can change it here by the color you would like to have, maybe red or blue. And on here you can fill another color for look um, the edges better. So maybe this and you can change the opacity you can go to the toggle alpha and look in the alpha mode so let's get and smooth this a bit 
or you can go back to the point you like here yeah choke is expanding okay and you can make refine matte mate motion blur it's good when you have a fast uh, movement and yes shutter angle high quality samples per frame and a lot of more so now uh, let's put this into um so i go back to my footage let's go and see here about the edges very bad so let's change it now you have here your footage and you have nothing to do um only put a image or movie animated background or any movie you want behind it I did it before so you will see here my background picture and here is the animation so let's go play this here you will see now the finished result with Roto Brush in After Effects CS5 so I think it's very nice because you don't need a green screen for any other and yeah so let me know in our video response with an example you can download the trial version on adobe.com and try it out so it's very nice I think it's very nice um, very um, time shortened um, because you don't have to move the mask the points and then go frame by frame and change the points the keyframes and yeah so see you next time by a new tutorial bye